Welcome to linuxm.com. In this session, you're going to see about how to install cfile on Ubuntu 16.04. cfile is a private cloud such as Dropbox. cfile is based on Python and it is open source so that you can be able to create your own private cloud for installing cfile on Ubuntu 16.04. For that, first you need to install the needed dependency packages. Here you can able to see the list of the packages that are need for installing C file and these are the dependency packages and press enter to continue the process of installing the dependency packages. The process of installing the dependency packages has been get started. Now give the password for the MySQL root user and press enter and retype it again and press enter The dependency files that are need for installing C file has been get completed successfully in my system. Now for installing bootu for that command pipe install bootu and press enter. The bootu package has been get successfully installed by using the pipe command. Now create one new user in the name of C file for installing the C file. For that command user add hyphen m hyphen s slash bin bash C file the name of the user and press enter. Now the user has been get created. Now create the password for that user for that command password and the name of the user c file and press enter now type the password for that user now the user has been get created now for downloading and extracting the c file archive for that you need to switch over as the c file user for that command su hyphen c file and press enter now it has been get switch over as the c file user for downloading the C file package for that command wget and the following link and press enter. The package has been get started to download. The C file package has been get downloaded. Now we extract the package for that command tar space hyphen x setf space the name of the package and press enter the package has been getting extracted successfully now rename the extracted package here you can able to see the name of the file c file iphone server iphone 6.04 i'm going to rename the file as c file iphone server for that command mv space c file iphone 6.04 it is going to be get renamed as C file hyphen server and press enter. Now the package has been get renamed. Now for creating the database, for that you need to log into the MySQL. For that command MySQL hyphen u root hyphen p and press enter and type the password for the root user. Now create a database in the name of cc.net underscore db for that command create database 
and the name of the database is init underscore db character set equal to utf8 now press enter now the database has been get created in the name of ccnet underscore db now create another one database in the name of c underscore db for that you need to change it as c underscore db and press enter now create another one database in the name of chub for that command chub underscore db and press enter now the database has been get created now create one user for accessing the database for that command create user and the name of the user at localhost identified by and the password for that user now the user has been get created now grant user to the database for that grant all privileges on the name of the database is in it underscore db dot star to the name of the user identified by and the password now give the permission for c file underscore db database for that command grant all privileges on c file underscore db dot star to name of the user identified by and the password now the permission has been get set for that user now give the permission for c hub file also for that command grant all privileges on the name of the database c hub underscore db dot star to the name of the user identified by and the password now the permission has been get set now give flash privilege for that command flash privileges now the privileges has been get flashed now give exit now for installing the c file for that you need to move inside the c file even server directory for that command cd c file and press enter now run dot slash setup hyphen mysql dot sh and press enter now the process has started now press enter to continue now type the name of the website and press enter now type the IP address now press enter to use the default location now press enter to set the default port number now press 1 to create a new database or press 2 to use the existing press 1 and press enter and press enter enter and type the root password for the mysql and press enter now type the name of the mysql user it is user1 and press enter give the password for that user press enter press enter 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 and press enter now the configuration has been get completed now for starting the c file for that command dot slash c file dot sh starter now the c file has been get started now for starting the c hub for that command dot slash c hub 
.sh start. Now the chub has been get started. Now give the email id for the admin account. Now type the admin password. Retype it again. Now it has again been get successfully created the C file admin. And the C hub has been get started successfully. For opening the C file, for that click on the browser. Now type the IP address of your machine. Colon 8000 and press enter. Here you can able to see the login page of the C file. Type the email ID. Now type the password. Here you can able to see the C file account has been get successfully logged in and it is a cloud storage. By using this you can able to create your storage and share with your clients. By using this you can also share your files the videos etc from windows to windows windows to linux we can able to share with windows clients and also linux clients and android ios etc here you can able to see the user memory by a particular user thank you for watching